Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be telling you guys inventions that need to happen. So let's get started. So uh, these are inventions that I, <coughs> excuse me, that I thought of myself. Also, my glasses turn into sunglasses. It's because it's outside. Because the sun is shining inside. So they might. I don't know if they will, but they may. Okay, anyway, I want to, before I get into this, but I just want to say the inventions that I wrote down, I have them in my notes to remember them. I thought of them myself. Okay, anyway. So I got this. Um, I want to show you guys this because I got this today at work and I thought it was really cute. It's like white, so it's going to get dirty easily. But I thought it was very cute. I like the shirts like this that are very flowy. And I thought it was like a cute summery shirt. So I got it. Um, I did try on a few other things too, but this is the only thing that I got. Um, there were some jeans that I was kind of skeptical, skeptical about getting, but then I was like, eh, summer, and uh, I don't know, because they were a little tight on me. Not much at all, like just on the verge of tightness. But I felt like if I put them in the washer, they would have like been too tight, and then I just, I don't know. So I didn't get them. I was very on the verge, though. Those, the other two things, I definitely knew I wasn't going to get. But anyway, so I only tried four things on. But yeah, so I got this for my work, Marshalls. It's cute. It's simple. Not too much to it has little like, as you guys can see, little like holes in it, but it's like cute holes. I don't know. I thought it was cute. You guys can, I'm not going to try it on for you guys, but you guys will see that on my Instagram sometime during the summer. I'll take some pictures with it. Okay, let's get into the inventions that need to happen. Um, because like literally these need to happen. Like need to happen. When I say this, I mean this. Also, I feel like I'm very good at like coming up with the ideas and inventions. I'm just not good at making them happen. Like I can't actually make the product. So I need someone who knows how to make inventions and me being the person who just tells them what to do. <laughs> Cause I have some good ideas. Okay, here we go. First one is an app or a camera. Like an app or a camera that somehow records your dreams. Like somehow that like you hook it up to your head or something like you were like a night head thing. And I don't know, just somehow, I don't know how it would work, but somehow there has to be one where you can record your dreams. How cool would that be? The only time I wouldn't like that is if at nighttime, I mean, not at nighttime, if you have a nightmare, that would be horrible. Like you don't want to relive your nightmares, but you can also not watch them if you don't want to watch them. Then you just record them every night. And, don't, and like you would have to like set it up every night. Obviously there would have to be like some sort of recording device that could like record it, but you'd have to set it up every night. And if you forget to set it up, then obviously you won't get your dream. It would just happen, but like, that'd be cool. That'd be so cool. Another one that I forgot to put on this list, but I remembered it right now, is gum. I said this once because I had this thought, like, before I went to sleep, and I said this to my parents, and they're like, oh, yeah, that'd be a good idea. So, basically, gum, that's like, if you, and I know, like, you're thinking, oh, there's Starburst, or oh, there's other candies that are kind of like this. Yeah, okay, there is, but I'm not talking about, like, real gum that lasts, like, hours. Like, maybe two, three hours. Maybe not that long. Maybe, like, an hour, an hour and a half. But... You chew it, it's like steak, when you get like really chewy steak, but it's like longer than that. And you can chew it, but eventually it'll break down and you can swallow it. And like you're able to swallow it. Like eventually it'll break down enough so you can swallow it. But like it takes a while before it breaks down. Like it takes a long time. So you're still chewing it like gum, but then eventually it'll break down and you can swallow it. So you don't have to waste the gum. Smart. Okay, next one is an app or Siri. It can be like Siri too can do this. But something that you can speak into. So probably Siri. Like it'd be better if it's Siri. Because then you don't have to download that. But it should be included with the Siri on the iPhones. And it would tell you. Like you tell it something like you want a food. Or you want an item. Or a fast food from like a fast food place or a restaurant. And instead of having to go online and actually order it. And wait for it to come. You would just you would just come instantly. And you wouldn't have to pay or anything. It would just instantly come. Like you just say oh I want this. And it just pops up out of nowhere and just comes. Like just delivers right then and there to you. That would be so cool. You know how cool that would be? You're just like, oh, I want a um, Charlotte Tilbury blush right now. Hey Siri, can you give me some tar Charlotte Tilbury blush? <laughs> I like how my Siri actually actually didn't want to say that. Anyway, so yeah. That would be super, super cool. Like, how cool would that be? Okay, next one. 
is eye drops oh my god this is perfect for people who wear glasses like even me but i don't have that big of a prescription and wearing glasses doesn't really bother me but it'd be cool if you can get eye drops that could have a prescription in them like you can go to the eye doctor and like they, they can make formulas for each individual prescription for your individual prescription and then they would make it for you and then you would get it every day you put in the eye drops every morning or whenever you get up and they would last a certain amount of time like 12 hours or something 12 to like 15 hours and then they'd wear off so like basically by the time you're gonna go to sleep they'd wear off and then in the morning you'd have to re put them in and you can just go back to your eye doctor and whatever and buy more so it's like normal eye drops but they'd be prescription and they would last a certain amount of time and then they'd wear off and then you'd have to like put more in but that would be so cool instead of having to have contacts or having to have glasses because sometimes contacts can be like painful and just hurt and be irritating and you know they're just and they're harder sometimes hard to put in and then glasses can just be kind of annoying because you have to remember to put them on every day and i don't know they can just be kind of annoying sometimes but i don't mind wearing glasses like honestly it doesn't bother me but not just people that have eye drops for people who wanted them okay next one so here's a really one that i said so a thermometer that would work as a covid test Basically, so you know a thermometer, you put it under your tongue and then it tells you your temperature. Like if you have a temperature and all. Well, it'd be cool if that could be a thing, but instead of it telling you if you have your temp a temperature, it will tell you if you have COVID or not. So you wouldn't have to do all the steps of actually doing like a COVID test because COVID tests, even like the rapid COVID tests you get at home, they still take a lot of time and they do like a lot of steps. And so, I mean, not that much time, but it does still. So it'd be cool if you could just have a thermometer that you put on your tongue and and then after a little bit, like it could take like maybe two, three minutes, maybe not even like a minute, and it would go off and then you would hear it and it would tell you COVID, no COVID. Okay, cool. Next one. Okay, so I don't know if you guys have heard of these, but they're, if you ever heard of Miracle Bell Berries, where they take things, like take food that is sour and turn it sweet. I wish they had that, the exact same thing, like their little tablet, like Miracle Berry tablet. I wish I had the exact same thing like that, but instead of taking um, sour things and turning them sweet, it would be taking spicy things and making them not spicy, like making them sweet or just something, just making them not spicy at all. Like taking any spicy thing, no matter how spicy it is, and making it not spicy, like at all, like making it seriously like there's not a single bit of spice on it. That would be incredible. You know how incredible that would be? Cause then I could eat like any food in the world. Like if my parents want to eat spicy food, because they like spicy food, I could just eat it, and I could just have the miracle berries before, and then all of a sudden I would just be able to eat it. You know how cool that'd be. Like I would never have to complain about like oh yeah, or my parents would never have to be like oh I can never have spicy food now. They would just be able to, and they would never have to dilute it for me. That would be so oh my god cool. Okay. Next one, an animal translator. Like, you can like, I don't know, it would be like an app or something. I don't know how they would do this, but some sort of animal translator that you can put it up to an animal and it would translate whatever the animal's saying to you. Like, how cool would that be? So you could literally understand what animals are saying. Like, what? That'd be really cool. Like, really cool. Okay, the last one I have is a phone, like an iPhone or any phone, a Samsung, but probably an iPhone because I like iPhones better, but it doesn't matter, both phones would have where the phone never runs out. I don't know how that would work, but never runs out of battery or storage. Like it'd be like infinity storage. And probably you could buy one that's infinity storage. I don't know. I think you can. That's unlimited storage. Can you buy a phone? I don't know about that, but it does, never runs out of battery. Like you never could charge it. Would always say it 100%. Always, no matter what you do on it, no matter how much stuff you do on it. I don't know how that would work because batteries always have to die down when you're using it a lot. It's impossible for it to stay low. But that would be so cool if you could have like a. If there's somehow you could put like a battery in the phone, that would be like. Like an unlimited battery that would never die. Ever. You never have to charge your phone. Ever. No matter the circuit. You can use it literally all day long. You can use it for the rest of your whole life. For like 20. Or even more years and it would never die like ever it would always hit 100 percent. that would be um literally the best thing ever it would save a lot of problems even on my phone i usually do i'm usually at home or usually 
and I have a charger available for me to charge it. But like, I don't know, that'd be so cool. Okay, so those are my little things that I want invented. Like if you guys have any, comment down below your um things you want invented or comment what you guys thought of the things I said, if you guys agree with any of the things I said, other things you would want to be invented. You know, another thing that would actually be kind of cool that I just thought of on the top of my head is if there was like a jacket or like a shirt or something that had like built-in AC for like the summertime. So whenever you're sweating, you can just like turn it on. There'd be like a built-in like fan in your shirt. Ooh, that'd be cool. Or in your pants or something. Ooh, think about that. Cause I've seen ones that have heaters. Like I've seen like jackets that have like a heater built in, but I've never seen ones with the cooling effect in the summer. That would be very cool. Okay, those are all my ones. Um, yeah. There's probably a lot more I can think of. I could do a part two in the future if I can think of any more things, but I probably could think of more things. I just have to think. But yeah, anyway, so if you guys already give me a thumbs up, like I said, comment down below all your thoughts on this. And also, if you guys have any inventions that you guys would wanna be invented, comment them down below. And yeah, I love you guys so, so, so much, and I'll see you guys next time. Subscribe, comment, and subscribe. Bye bye, testers.